Hey everybody, this is Andrew Ball with the Ball Brothers. We're here in Bolivia with the organization Child Fund International. And if you've been to one of our concerts, you've heard us talk about this organization and this ministry and how much it means to us personally. And we wanted to bring this ministry to you on Facebook. As we know that many times, some of you who watch us through Facebook are overseas or may not have a chance to make it to one of our concerts. And so we wanted to bring the story of our trip here to Bolivia to you. Coming to Bolivia, we had an expectation that we were going to see areas of need and areas of poverty. But I think the thing that I found most shocking is when you're out here and see that this area goes on and on and on and on for as far as the eye can see in any direction, I think that's where your heart breaks because you realize the need is so great. To see the hardships and the difficulties that they endure every single day here on the ground and to know that we can go back to the United States and tell their story, we can make a difference in these people's lives. My wife and I decided to sponsor a little boy from Bolivia because we knew we were getting ready to take a trip there. And we thought it'd be great if while in Bolivia, we could stop by and visit this boy and his family in their home. When we pulled up to the gate of that house, in Seoul, the family standing there, surrounded by poverty as far as the eye could see, it really started to sink in exactly how much the sponsorship meant to this child and his family. We're here in La Paz, Bolivia with Romero, a boy, little boy that our family is, has the opportunity of sponsoring. And uh, what's interesting is once we got into this area and got in the community where Romero lives is that there's more children that are in need of sponsorship in this area. So it's just great to be able to have a small part in what God is doing here, not only in Romero's life and Romero's family and his home, but seeing an entire community transform all through this area. So I know if you're like me, when you first hear about Child Fund International, you begin to question, what is it that these children are getting? What is it that this ministry is providing to them? And well, I've been here on the ground, I've seen it firsthand and I can tell you, clean drinking water, something that is not accessible to many of these folks who live in these remote parts of the village. They, they have either no running water or very contaminated poor water, which brings along so many different issues, especially for the younger children. They get nutrition in so many different forms and not just in giving them food, but also in teaching them to plant their own renewable food sources. And it's just a great progression how they bring that about. They get health care and health checkups and well-being checkups. They also teach them job education and training things to get them out of this cycle. So there's so many things that it's hard to even put into words all the different aspects that Child Fund International brings to these children. It is a program that I absolutely believe in. In the country of Bolivia, clean water is a big problem. Although this might look like clean water, it's actually not. It's filled with a lot of parasites that can cause harm to the children that are gonna actually attempt to drink this. Child Fund has come in and educated people. This is an example of one of the filtration system that they would actually put on the roof. The sun comes in and it actually boils out all of the bad stuff that they would be drinking. When you're in an area of poverty and you're seeing all these children in these different areas, you see a look of hopelessness and it's hard to describe until you see it firsthand. But the children that are sponsored through their program, there's something different about them because they have hope. They have something to look forward to. And every child that we saw that had been involved in the program for any length of time would be able to take us and show us their sponsorship letters. And although they might have had next to nothing in the houses that they lived in, they saved those letters to bring them out and to show them to us. So one of the things that Child Fund has done is begin to teach the people here how to use just what limited space they have in this very rocky mountainous region to plant and grow their own food sources. And the family was proud to show us that they're growing zucchini in here and uh, have a whole garden set up in this area of sustainable food sources so that they can literally feed their family through the education and through the program uh, through Child Fund. Since we've been here, we're even more motivated to go back into the United States and spread this to as many people as we can. These kids need your help. Many people will sponsor one of these children to change that child's life. But what they will ultimately find is that in sponsoring that child, it will change your life.